Welcome back everybody. So today we are making a bowl out of lime wood. We're just marking the mortise out here. And marking out for a foot. Okay, now we're going to get it turned to shape. First tool we're going to be using is the mid sized detailer from Easywood Tools. Now I'm going to switch to the mid-size rougher. And there we go. So now we're going to turn ourselves to the bottom of the bowl. And the first tool we're going to use is the mid size detailer. And we're just going to make a little mark there to define where the mortise is going to go. We're going to hollow it out with the number one hollower. Flatten the surfaces off with a mid-size rougher. And match the dovetails of the jaws with the mid-size detailer. Okay, I have done most of the sanding already, so we're just going to show you the 240 grit sandpaper. Grain out with some methylated spirits or denatured alcohol. There's some sand in sealer. And some Yorkshire Grit Abrasive Paste. There shall be links in the description as to where you can purchase this. There we go, just uh, buff it in and you'll end up with the equivalent of around about a thousand grit.
There we go. And now we're ready for the next step, which is some Hampshire Sheen finishing wax. Once again, there'll be links down below in the description if you want to purchase any Hampshire Sheen products, including the wax. Just wiping it all over now. Laid quite slow. Yeah, you wait for all the vapors to evaporate, wait for it to go a bit tacky, and then you buff it in. Remember not to push too hard, so you wipe off the wax. Just uh, just enough pressure to heat the uh, heat the wax up and buff it into the wood. There we go. Okay, so now we're going to do the, the top of the bowl now. We're going to start with the number one hollower and hollow it all out. Slow-mo there. I love how the uh, the number one hollow makes light work of hollowing out the wood. Does it so easily. There's a mid-size finisher, just to take out any ridges that may have happened whilst hollowing. A mid-sized detailer just to round over that little uh, that little detail at the top. And yeah, on to sanding again. So obviously, once again, I uh, I'd already sanded most of it. So we're just going to show you the 240 grit. And obviously, my apologies, I, uh, I forgot to turn the light on at this point. So it's a little bit dark, but it won't be like this for long. There we go. Bit of methylated spirits just to wipe all the sawdust off and clean the grain. Sanding sealer. Some Yorkshire grit. Okay. 
And there's the light again. And we're finishing off with some more hamster cheese. Wiping it all over with a lathe pretty slow again, get full even coverage. There you go, wait for the fumes to evaporate. And once again, just buff it in. There will be some pictures at the end. If you remember, if you like this video, please remember to give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and uh, share it with your friends. And until the next one, I'll see you later. Bye bye for now.